Taurus. Today is May 21st. I have a short reading for you. So to jump right into it, you guys are up in your head. I need you to stop being up at night and just sleep. You know, I mean, the Four of Swords is here. So it kind of says, you know, you're going to rest and take it easy or whatnot. But it seems as though when you do lay down, excuse my finger, when you do lay down, you are plagued by certain thoughts. It's not necessarily a bad thing because the magician is here. Knight of Pentacles, Ten of Pentacles. So are you thinking about your stability? I mean, your money looks good. Your money does look good, guys. So whatever it is, you are up at night. I mean, you could be brainstorming too. You know, but there is some type of thought going on when you guys should be resting. Or it's possible you could even be putting like certain thoughts to rest. You're not going to even stress or worry or whatnot. Because the magician is here. This is like manifestation energy. You guys could also have a manipulator in your midst. So you might want to, you know, look out for that. But it's, it's kind of like a bittersweet reading because you've got judgment king of pentacles queen of pentacles i'm falling off my seat here shoot this is what i get for having coffee before your reading is like i can't sit still king of cups seven of pentacles so you guys are putting to rest a divine partnership at least you're thinking about it that was the thoughts of it is either you're going to put it to rest or you're trying to figure out how to breathe life into it. I mean, you can't get it no better than this king and queen of pentacles together. This is a stable couple. It's also an earth couple. So your Taurus, your counterpart could be Capricorn, Virgo, another Taurus like yourself. By a long shot, even a Libra that's stable because Taurus and, and Libra are ruled by Venus. So, you know, like your sister sign or whatever. Um judgment king of pentacles queen of pentacles king of cups it's like you're learning to control your emotions learning to control your love you're not gonna be so quick with it and the reason why i say that is it's next to the seven of pentacles this is like slow moving slow growing so it's like you guys are really embracing your earth energy you are not rushing for anything okay i think you guys may have had to cut something out, so I don't know if you're really going to rebirth it, right? But what you guys had to cut out, King of Swords, Page of Wands, it was like some type of a, um, a love. Like, it was like childish. It's a shame because Two of Cups is usually, this is a choice you've made your choice in love. But I think that choice came with too much deception and, you know... You know, the emotional games, leaving somebody out in the cold. You don't want to talk to somebody today. You know, you ghost people, you dead people, stuff like that. Meanwhile, they have this love for you. So with the King of Swords here, I'm, I'm thinking that you guys view this as something very childful, child, childish and young, immature, you know, sneaky, just you didn't have the greatest look on it and i think you cut it out so what we would have in your final advice let me just unplug this because i'm dragging the cord all over sorry guys what you have as your final outcome in your advice position just for this one day just for this one week guys not forever is five of cups king of wands emperor page of pentacles strength card so it's kind of like yeah something hurt you guys are like you know thinking about the heartbreak the grief the loss the misery it's just it's something that happened recently so it's still fresh in your mind and fresh in your heart but you're not gonna let that stop you because you've got the king of wands here. This is a person that moves forward. He seizes the opportunities. Carp DM. He seizes that day. He goes forward. The emperor is a control. Con not a controlling person. He can be. But I think you've, you're learning to control your passions. You're learning to control your love. You're learning to 
it's, it's a different way of moving. You're going to get up and be a go-getter and go do stuff, but you're not going to be like frightened Friday and just run and rush all over things. You're controlling it. You're moving with a purpose, okay? And the thing is, you're moving towards a greater opportunity, Ace of Pentacles and Strength card. So the Strength card. So there's determination here to move forward put your best foot forward and do things that are for your own good your highest good and they serve your best interest right for some of you i don't know if you're going to reconcile because there's like no reunion cards here there's still love here but there's too many painful memories too many painful memories and you guys are not wallowing in your pain you're not if somebody hurts you you're not, you know, sitting home in the dark crying about it. You are out there working. And you know what? With this emperor here, I just heard it. You see your worth and you know your value. So whatever the situation was, you're not going to let it tear you down. The emperor is here. Strength card is here. So you guys are determined. Give me one more message. I have the magician, which is one. I have the emperor, which is four. That's five. Judgment is 20, 25. Strength is 8. 25 and 8 is 32. 5. North, south. Okay, so 5 in the major arcana is the Hierophant. The Hierophant and Judgment combination. I'm sorry, I'm reading the major arcanas only to see what the hidden message here is. So the hidden message here is to do right by yourself okay um it involves institutions it could also involve marriage so it could be an ending the hierophant and judgment combined can talk about endings putting things to rest because the judgment card is when the soldier has fought died in battle he lived an honorable life and he is waiting for the angel to sound his golden trumpet and be reborn in a better more prosperous life so the message here guys is for you to yeah be a little bit more self-serving do what's right for you something um maybe coming to an end you know marriage um you guys could be elevating on a higher spiritual plane because the hierophant deals with all of that right um what else what else? What else is in these cards? You guys are looking really good, Taurus. I love it. I love this stable energy and your grad is like graduating. You guys are elevating. So I think I'm going to leave this here for now and I will be back to check on you. Enjoy your weekend. I hope everything is, you know, happy and prosperous for you. Your money looks good. If you had any pit bulls or anything like that, like your money is good, guys. And, um, I'll be back. So, I don't know. Drop your comments. Thank you for your likes, your subscribes, your shares. I'm going to stop rambling. And that's it. Bye, guys.